You've had some great reactions so far from critics and audiences. You must feel, you know, lit up inside that so many people have responded to it in such a positive way so far. Yeah, yeah, it's it's beautiful. It's it's beautiful because when you make a movie, you have no idea where it's going to go, and you have no idea what the reception will be. And it's such a particular film, so it's been very, very, very exciting to to see how it has been played. Yeah. What was it about the? Obviously, it's a very original script and has a very original kind of idea. You know, people would maybe see the poster and think, oh, it's a biopic of Papa Neruda when it's kind of a bit more than that. What was it about the script when you both read it that, that kind of appealed to you and thought, oh, this, I have to make this film? Uh, well, when it was basically the, the, um, the explanation that Pablo gave me about what he wanted to do uh, with the film before I read the script. Uh, then I read it and, and then again came uh, Pablo to, to tell me more or less the spin he wanted to give to things and the, the approach and um, it is, you know, it's, I don't know, it's hard for me to, to accept that scripts are the guiding line for me to, to get interested into a project. It's more what the director has to say, you know, rather than the story itself. So uh, I'm, I'm, I'm completely, you know, just, yeah, a story can be any story, but it's about what the director wants, in a way. Or wh wh where does it want to head it, you know? Uh, nonetheless, it was interesting, the point of view from the, from the script, uh, straightforward, that there was going to be this policeman that was going to be a kind of a narrator, um, and then a kind of, a, I don't know, there was going to be a literary game uh, going throughout there, but the script is very different and changed many, many ways. I mean, when we, even when we were shooting it, I mean, it was a different script altogether than what the film came out. For you, Pablo, as a director, what was it about this story that kind of appealed to you? That you, you know, something that you could get your, get your team well, into? Well, it was it was a long process uh, that it took us a, a couple of years to 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 really get to what we wanted to do, and uh, all this was thank but. Uh, uh, to Guillermo Calderón, who actually wrote the script, and and I think we started with a very conventional biopic on Neruda and and, and, and the years where this movie takes place, where communism was uh, declared illegal and Neruda had to run away and, and sort of became some sort of a fugitive. And and then I was struggling, I have to say, to I, I don't like biopics very much, and and I, we sort of went up to something that we like to call an anti-biopic. And, and I think what I really personally sort of got more comfortable and excited about the film is when we found uh, Gael's character, uh, because that was the door to to have an interpretation and and to be able to playful with the story and sort of to have an approach to his poetry throughout, um, you know, throughout the, the, the role of a cop. And, and then and then Luis came on board, who's the, who's the actor who plays uh, Neruda, and then uh, Mercedes Moran, and then finally Gael um, came on board as well. So we were all, all, almost to sort of have this family playing with Neruda's toys. I don't think this movie it's about Neruda. It's more about the Nerudian cosmos, about this world, about what he created, the combination of, of multiple cinema layers that are associated to to noir cinema, to a black comedy, like a road movie at some point, it's a Western. Um, and all that sort of mixed in, mixed up things, uh, it's what we were um, looking for. And I don't know, it's just exciting. We, you never know how the movie's going to be. And, and we're filmmakers and, and just the process of making it was just so beautiful. And just quickly, I wanted to ask you about Louis' performance because he's fantastic in the movie. What was it like to work with him and for him to bring that character to life was he someone that you that you'd seen before and thought oh he'd be perfect for, for this well I, I've worked with him and, mm. and, and nobody knows it's so funny because he he had a wig uh, in No and plays a Gael's uh, boss <laughs> in, in, in Gael's hired by by, by Luis in in, in, in No and so it's someone that I love and respect so much and uh, that I've been working with for many many years and other things so it was always the natural guy to to play him, and it was just a beautiful experience. It, yeah, it's very hard. For, you you could understand for us uh, that you call any actor and tell him, "Man, you want to play Neruda?" It's, that that could be very frightening. And 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 Luis has these skills. It's, it's a guy that is very funny. That he comes from comedy, um, but it's the type of actors that are comedian. But when they go serious, they could be very very serious. And and he has beauty, danger, and this is sort of very expansive poetic way of acting, so I thought it was wonderful. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! 
Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, 